A little bit breezy, a little bit cool, and certainly a little on the wet side in parts of the valley. Nothing real heavy, but everybody's getting at least a little bit of rain. And you can see it's still kind of damp and uh, dreary in Hanover, York County right now. Hanover at 57. It was one of the warmer spots, if you will. Dew point at 55, and they got into a south-southwesterly breeze. There's a warm front right about south of Route 30 right now. Uh, north of that warm front, though, some spots stayed in the 40s. Show you those temperatures coming up for, for the evening hours. Cloudy, some showers, but they'll be ending, I think, by 8 or 9 o'clock, 8 o'clock, 7 o'clock, western counties, maybe up to about 9, 10 o'clock, eastern counties. Uh, it's still going to be breezy, though, and the winds are going to kick in in the northwest. That's going to dry it out. And temperatures a couple degrees either side of 50 and mostly in the 40s and then down in the low 40s overnight tonight. Could even be a few 30s if your neighborhood clears out a little more. This colder air, I try to check where it's coming from. And in, uh, in Michigan, and that's where this air is coming from. Yesterday morning, they were in the upper 30s. So I'm not, I'm not convinced we can't get into the 30s tonight. Skies will be clearing, though. It'll be breezy and cool for tomorrow. Temperatures mid to upper 50, slightly below normal, but not a bad last Friday in October kind of day. So here's the rainfall. You can see the cloud picture showing one batch moved through earlier. Now we get the second batch coming in, getting some moderate showers. Here's the end of it. It's a cold front. It's back to our west and it's going to zip on through as we go uh, through the evening hours. Now temperatures generally got into the 50s and then 60s to our south. But in the valleys, we kind of tend to hold on to some of that cooler air, and we stayed on the cooler side. You can see up in Erie, it's in the 40s again, 52 in Pittsburgh, where they're starting to clear out. Here's the radar, heaviest now, Adams, parts of Franklin counties, and has some moderate showers up in the parts of the Lebanon Valley. There's that back edge of the showers, though, already to the west, temperatures in the 40s and 50s. We'll time it out for you. Predictor shows that last edge of the showers coming through. This is about 9 o'clock. And then they're out of here. We'll see some clearing, but still some clouds around overnight into early tomorrow morning. Then I think we see plenty of sunshine through tomorrow afternoon. Going to be a nice day, but a little on the breezy cool side. And certainly going to be kind of chilly for high school football for tomorrow evening. Look, Saturday though. We turn it right around. It looks like a mild weekend, but there could be a few showers around on Sunday, and that'll probably keep us into the 60s on Sunday. Monday, a little bit cooler for trick-or-treaters out there. And then as we head through the rest of next week, it stays on the mild side, mid to upper 60s, I think, as we go on into Thursday. So fairly mild seven-day forecast, but it's still kind of rainy and raw. That makes the roads a little wet. Lots of leaves on the roads, too. That can make it a little slick. Let's see how things are going. Corinne? Well